Matt Barzell, first shooter against Caden Primo. Off the post, and it stays in the crease. He went to the back end, he beat the goaltender, but the iron kept it out. And I'm not sure how much breath he had because he was on for a long time out in the in the five on three and looked to me like he just couldn't generate the kind of speed. So now it's Cole Caulfield two goals in regulation and as skilled as they come with speed wide left drifting back and Varlamov closed the door. Oh yeah a good job by Barley to show him the five hole and then shut it down had a stick flat on the ice between his legs which is what you're supposed to do just watch him. I mean, just good position, just yeah. quicker than him. Just a little cat and mouse, right? Just yeah. waiting about, not really biting on anything. We haven't seen him in a shootout, have we? I, I watched him in practice. Had some pretty good moves. On, we'll see what, what he can do. First NHL shootout attempt for Max Siplikov. Oh, he had him, and he missed the net. He had Primo down. He pulled it to the backhand, missed it wide. Well, there comes the next Next, next, next dog. And you know what? There's oh, be, boy, before yeah. before every game, the goalies get a look at every single guy shoot up. There's no book on Siplikov, right? So a little advantage there. But I, I think Primo might have got his skate on it on that second look. Here's Nick Suzuki weaving back and forth. Second shooter for Montreal, and a puck check for Varlamov keeps the shootout scoreless. You talk about the speed, Butch. We haven't seen anyone come in. Everyone's been methodical. Everyone's come in from an angle and watch the stick from Varley. A great little poke. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a big fan of scoring slow. I just think it gives the goaltender too much time to, to set up. Bo's a shooter, so I would expect him to shoot. Bo Horvat, third round. It's the break. Stopped by Primo, but it rolled behind him. And then scored in wide. When you get in that close, it's hard to beat a goaltender because he's taking your angle away. And now this man here can can win it all for the. And that's and that's the defenseman now. Lane Hudson, Lane Hudson, who's playing in just his seventh National Hockey League game. No point for Barlamov. Defenseman, Lane Hudson, stopped by Varlamov as he kept it along the ice. Uh, Barley goes, not, not so quick, kid. Not so quick. You got to do better than that. Too. We were scheduled for three rounds. We will need at least four. As Hudson stopped by Varlamov, and now Kyle Paul Murray has a chance to put the pressure on Montreal. Really good shooter, this guy right here. Right handed shot coming in right side. Slows up and scores! What a rip! The Islanders a save away from the victory. Boy, you talk about elevating in a hurry. Is that the exact same spot that he scored yeah, that's in the, the first period? Yeah, that's in the toy department. Wow. I mean, yeah, he's right there. And just that patience, right? He just held it, held it, held it, waited for the drop, picked his spot. Here's Oliver Kapanen, another rookie and an unknown. Yeah, young, young kid, right-hander. His fifth NHL game. High glove. Needs to score. Kapanen scores. Glove side on Varlamov, and the shootout continues. How did you know, Butch? Uh, okay. Right hander, you got to go around the glove. Thought he might go higher. And Varley knew he was going to shoot. He was way out on him, but that's a quick release by the youngster. A way out front and just gets it to the forehand and no Good chance shooter. to make the save. Simon Holmstrom will be the fifth shooter for the Islanders. Holmstrom, what a move, and he slams it into an open net. Well, Butch, he, he's just got such a long reach that if you're the goaltender and you're going to that puck, watch how quick he can pull it right here. Wow, what a move by Simon Holmstrom. Yeah, he, I mean, no chance for the goaltender there. He, he bit hook, line, and sinker. And here you go with a great chance to win the game. And it's another rookie, Emil Heineman, the 22-year-old Swede. Now uh, left-hander. Heineman against Varlamov. And he scores. Picked his corner glove side on Varlamov. Wow. And the shootout will see yet another round. Uh, I mean, the two kids, spectacular. That's not an easy shot, but watch where he shoots us from. He's right at the hash marks. And I mean, no chance for Varlamov. That's uh, and Varley's tr out trying to bait him and to deacon him. And there's Cash. 
Pash, a right-hander. Nobody scored on the first three shots for either team. Now everybody scored on the last two. J.G. Pajot, just his fourth career shootout attempt. Pajot, blocker save Primo. Got to, you got to fake. You got, you got to get a little fake. You got to get him thinking a little bit. Right-hander, high glove. I think may, maybe he liked what Kyle Palmieri did, but yeah, touch different sure. approach. Coaches are just freestyling here at this point, right? You're going who? Who's, who I think who's a rookie? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now, now you're, you're you don't know who to who to use. Chance for Montreal to win it for Alex Newhook. Newhook save for Lamont. I think Butch he had trouble settling that thing down. Watch him come in. The puck just hops a tiny bit. I don't think this is what Newhook had in mind, but right yeah, it's wrapped there. Up nice right now. This was only scheduled for three rounds. Brock Nelson will be the Islanders' seventh shooter. Brock loves to go five hole. We'll see if he goes five hole. Nelson left handed shot wide right. Blocker save. Just trying to beat him with a straight shot. Didn't work. Well, Brock Nelson, we, we talked about speed. Brock likes to pick those corners. Now you got another defenseman going. That's two in the first six for Montreal. Matheson's a skilled player. Islanders had two chances to win. This is the second chance for Montreal to win it. Mike Matheson lost the handle. Varlamov was there in case he did. Well, there's not a lot of guys left. Wow, we got Ro Romeo. I, I watch Romeo in shootouts. He's got some moves, so it wouldn't shock me for him to score. The former Montreal Canadian defenseman Alexander Romanov will be the eighth shooter for the Islanders against Caden Primo. Romanov, glove save. You know, Butch, this is the time when you're a defenseman or you're someone, you're either hiding on the bench or you're looking back at your coach saying, why not me? Yeah. It's one or the other, though. You'll see some guys get pretty small oh, on the end of the bench now. Well, here's supposed to be a skilled player. Wonder why he hasn't shown up sooner. Meanwhile, Martin St. Louis could dust off a number one overall pick for his eighth shooter and a chance to win it against Varlamov. Speed on speed and a save from Varlamov. Boy, I thought they were going to collide as they both came charging towards one another. Yeah. Well, on the shootouts, you know, if you don't make your move early, you're not going to, because you get in too tight, and then you've got no room to hoist it. Another defenseman. Round nine will start with Noah Dobson. His fourth career shootout attempt. As Dobson picks it up at center. Round nine. Score! He came in with speed, he went glove side and fired it home. Yeah, snapped it in there right away. Caught the goaltender in, in deep. Watch where the goaltender is. He's inside his crease, gives him a lot more room for, for the Domber to put it in. And here's the guy that scored a goal a little earlier, his first goal in the National Hockey League. I'm betting on Barley in this situation. Second NHL game for Logan Mayu. Game on the line, and he missed it wide, and the Islanders win! It took 65 minutes and nine rounds of a shootout, but the Islanders win on home ice 4-3 over Montreal.